Welcome to this the state of quality report 2022 review. This is the software and testing training channel and my name is Inder P Singh. The topics that I will talk about are what are the introduction to this important report, quality at speed findings, test automation insights, artificial intelligence in test automation, what you can expect in your QA career in 2022 and finally important recommendations and benefits of reading this report. The state of quality report is made by Catalon. Catalon provides test automation tools and platform that can be easily integrated with other products. Catalon is well known in the industry. Catalon tools are used in more than 100k enterprises more than 1 million projects in 160 plus countries. More than 1 million testers and developers use Catalon products. Catalon makes annual reports based on surveys and interviews of QA professionals. In 2020, they made the report on test automation landscape. In 2021, on continuous testing navigator. And now in 2022, on the state of quality. This report gives insights into the state of software quality and recommendations to improve QA practices. Benefits of the State of Quality Report 2022 You will know the skills to have for future test automation and automation testing roles by reading this report. Also you will know useful test automation strategy and automation testing tools to use as Quality Assurance Analyst. Now part one of the report is quality at speed. Catalon found that effective techniques are test automation, code review, production testing, automated unit testing and also shift left testing. The challenges faced by QA professionals were frequent requirement changes because they needed to update the tests and lack of time, lack of time resulting in less test automation. In test automation, Catalon found that test automation is used for regression testing by 53% of the respondents, test cases generation 42%, functional testing etc. Also for test results analysis, test data generation, performance testing, etc. The most popular test automation tools are these ones here. So we can see Selenium, Postman, Catalon Studio, TestNG, Cucumber and so on. Actually over the years testers are gradually shifting from open source tools for test automation to commercial solutions. Selenium users dropped from 86% of the respondents in 2018 to 37% in 2021, while Catalon Studio is the third most commonly used tool with 21% of the respondents using it. The possible reason is that the test automation frameworks need to be built in open source tools but are typically built in the commercial tools. Part 3 of the report is AI in test automation. Here Catalon found that AI is in initial stages only in test automation. AI is being used for test script generation, test data generation, automated defect detection and test selection. AI usage in test automation is expected to increase to support more activities like test management, test maintenance test execution, reporting, etc. in all of these areas. Part 4 of the report deals with expectations in 2022. So these expectations are that the test automation would increase, QA practices, processes and tools would improve to enable more efficient testing and AI technologies would enable more tasks like test estimation, test repair, 
defect detection and performance analysis the benefits to you to get the report and read it are this report explains the current state of quality in detail there are many recommendations that may benefit your QA career for example recommendations related to production monitoring and testing also related to dynamic software analysis pair programming and model driven development there is a catalog case study in the report to reduce time to market and to reduce test execution time you will also get a chance to win a $30 e-gift card the link to get catalogs the state of quality report 2022 is in the video description so you can click on it and get the report for you thank you